Now before I start this video, I just want to admit that I got these clips from B-Ball Breakdown. They have a great basketball channel. Check them out. But I already knew about these pick and rolls, but I noticed something while I was watching the video. Spain pick and roll is what this video is about. It's the same thing as a pick and roll, but you have a guard or whoever back screening on that big that you see right here. And I don't know if it came from Spain. I know it came from overseas, but I wanted to examine if there's any more action you can get out of that back screener or any, you know, lob or backdoor plays. Now here you'll see uh, Bledsoe is on Gordon's back and he's watching his every move. And now this is good defense. But say if this is Wessel Westbrook, he could easily turn around and jump and get a dunk, a layup, a foul, whatever, you name it, if he's being overplayed as soon as he goes to set that screen. It can happen, and it could be a read on this, on this play, especially if you have a big that likes to pop to keep him out the lane, or if you have a point guard who's maybe not as savvy to get into the rim, or whatever. These pieces can be interchangeable. Now here you'll see that uh, John Wall gets a wide open dunk, and it's because the back screener's guard never came over to help. And that made the back screener not open for a backdoor play, but say if he did and Gortat was a pop option big who can shoot the three. Either Gortat's going to be wide open or that back screener is going to get a drop off. Now I really don't know if this can work. I'm just, you know, thinking while I'm, you know, watching actions. But if Zeller is a pop threat and the back screener is an inside threat, it'll make it more effective. So if they take away that inside, the three is there. Now also I'm thinking, what if Capella could shoot a three? So like Kevin Love, plug him in here and he goes to the elbow. Beverly essentially will be flare screening him out to the elbow, which the guy in the paint would have to come out and run at him, in which Beverly could easily be open for a lob or a three, I mean, or a layup, etc. Now, even if this can't happen or if it's too tough, it'll even make a more effective pick and roll because the back screener's defender has to be worried about him backdooring him and then the guys on the corners have to be worried about him getting the layup also so it'll just open up more for the teammates anyway let me know what you think let me know if i'm wrong i'm crazy i'm not a coach but you know i'm just watching and i'm seeing what i see